feel so American. <laughs> to say I love y'all but I need for y'all to watch the whole video and read the description box before you ask questions because 10 times out of nine I've answered your question in the video or in the description box so do me that favor y'all do it please I love you <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be my take on a patriotic 4th of July makeup look. Something that I would wear to a party or pretty much. It's gonna be a sort of dramatic look. This is gonna be a talk through because I never do talk through, so foundation. Now, I have been struggling. I don't know if you've seen in my last get ready with me like my foundation was like super orange i'm really struggling with foundation right now because nothing that i have matches me so i've been trying to mix and match stuff together so i'm going to be mixing today this smashbox camera ready bb water and the color is medium dark and i'm going to be using um Cadiz by NARS, the All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation. Both of these are really, who's calling me? And I'm gonna be using a damp beauty blender. I'm just using this right now. This one's on the full coverage side. Like I didn't, I don't have that much on and it's covering like everything. And this is my exact color. What, I've been tripping. Tripping and slipping. Another tip for summer makeup, wear a lightweight foundation and then, or like a BB cream or something. And then if you still have imperfections, you can just spot conceal so you're not so cakey. So I am gonna go in with this MAC Select Cover Up and my color is NC45. And another tip for oily people, um, you always want to use a primer. I did do this off camera. I probably should have did it on camera, but um, Becca Ever Matte Poreless Priming Perfector is, I've had this for a year and I still have psh, three year supply. Like this stuff never runs out. So. Next, I'm gonna do my brows. I'm gonna be using this NYX Micro Brow Pencil in the color Chocolate. So now I'm going to go in with this eye crayon by Sephora. It is a waterproof colorful crayon. Crayon colorful. It's in the color 39 My Boyfriend's Jeans. It's a blue. And I'm going to first put the concealer this concealer on my eyelids to prime them and then I'm going to set it with some setting powder set these eyelids because I have oily eyelids I don't know about you but if I don't set my eyelids they will be oily throughout the day so I need that extra assurance you know That I'm not going to be creasing and oily. Just, 
it's not cute okay it's not cute going with saddle in my crease as a transition color i'm going to use the same brush it's just a fluffy blending brush and i'm going to do like circular motions and then like windshield wiper motion I'm gonna go in, I think this color is called Filthy Rich. This one right here. And this palette is the Struggle Palette. I had the hardest time putting this in here. So that's why this one is like messed up, but I'm gonna use this color and this color out of the palette. I'm gonna have those listed down below because I, I have to look it up because I can't take this part out to look at the eyeshadow. So, um, I'm going in with that brown shade. It's a really, really warm brown. And I'm going to be using this like pointed blending just so it can be a little bit more precise in the crease. So I have uh, that in my crease. Now I'm going to go in with this crayon and I'm going to apply that to my lid. I'm gonna go back in my crease with the same um, warm brown right here just to blend everything together. I'm gonna use like this thick packing eyeshadow brush. I don't know what to call it, but and I'm just going to um, put that all over the lid. I'm just gonna go back in with this same brush and blend this blue out. NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. The color I'm in is Ginger. I'm quickly gonna set that. I'm gonna use um, this MAC Select Sheer Pressed Powder. Um, an NC40 and it looks like this and then I'm going to use my La Mercier translucent setting powder on top the reason I use this is because it has a color and it's gonna cancel out that flashback and that's gonna set everything in place I noticed when I use just this I still crease so I still have to use that on top and then for the rest of my skin I'm gonna use this mineralized skin Mineralized foundation in loose and this color is medium dark Now I'm gonna go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills contour kit. This is the powder and it's medium to tan and I'm gonna use the color Espresso It just looks like this Elf brush. It's an angle brush I'm going to use that just to warm my face up and I'm going to go in like circular motions. I'm going to go in um, my Smashbox contour kit and this is the deep the deepest one, the darkest one, whatever. 
and I'm gonna go in with this shade and I'm going to put it right in the center and just go upwards. I'm gonna use a smaller brush for that. This is by Coastal Scents. It's a small angle brush. First I'm gonna do saddle. First I'm gonna do saddle and then I'm gonna put that on top just to kind of make it smoky. I have applied my lashes and I've done my mascara for my low lash line. I think I wanna add a little bit more of that warm shade to the bottom of my lash line highlight um it's out of the nyx avant pop pop palette and it's this rose gold type of shade and honey So I don't went and changed my clothes and put my earrings on. I'm gonna be using American Doll by Anastasia Beverly Hills, the lips, the liquid lipstick. I really, let me just say, I really enjoy these liquid lipsticks. Smooth like Lord. velvety smooth like regular lipstick that's what it feels like a regular kind of feels like a lip gloss like it's really thick but like really smooth girl i don't know i don't have the answers i'm an american american like so now you gotta spray your face you gotta last through this whole party you have to last so use this or use this this is the all nighter. This is the matte finish. It's up to you. I'm gonna use this one. Yeah. Yes, I do use that much on a daily. Like this is almost empty and I just got it. This helps to number one set everything in place and number two like all the powders and stuff you put on your face it helps to blend everything and it makes your highlight pop i'm out i will see you guys in my next video i just want to say Thank y'all so much for all the love on my last video, the one about my hair. Y'all show out. Thank y'all so much. I'm happy. I just wanna say thank you. I love you guys so much. I just wanna say thank y'all so much for subscribing and for loving me and for supporting me. My, my, my mascara is not waterproof continue to let me know what you guys want to see i'll see you in my next video peace